help me, cowboy guy? Oh, cowboy guy ain't coming to save you. Keep crying. It sounds like music to me while I drink this stolen, uh, what's the word? Booze. Oh, that's right, booze. I just love booze. <laughs> hey. Look, there's cowboy guy. I don't know who you are or where you're from, Mr. Wolf Coyote thing, but you better get out of my town before I make you. Well darn, he actually showed up! Well, what are you waiting for? Come get some! You know, I think I will. Hey, Piano Guy, please play some cool fight music. Thanks, Piano Guy. Oh man, I actually did it! Oh man, uh, well, thank you, uh, thank you, piano guy. Uh, that song was great. I, uh, wait, um, does does anyone else hear that sound outside? Um, uh, hey everyone. So I I am guessing you all heard about the uh, the the coyote attack. I uh, what what. What is everyone doing here? Was it on the news or something? As just previously seen, Cowboy Guy has done it yet again. Our spunky sheriff has once again saved us from the wrath of a crazy little creature. For those who remember, and how couldn't you, the great gem of Balbazar and its innate ability to control the sands of the very desert we live in. That snake brigade and the fight to run the flag line to claim right over the town's 300-year-old flag. The Living Mountains of the West, and the fight to lasso the mountain with the fabled Golden Rope of Gold! And who could forget a year ago today, Sheriff Scorpion, or should I say ex-Sheriff Scorpion, and the intense hostage case Cowboy Guy faced when trying to get his beautiful badge back. This incident today is only a win to be remembered, with the only loss being parts of the wall of the good old saloon and a bit of the bank. Well, you've heard it here from our on-the-spot correspondent cameraman, Cam. Cowboy guy has done it again. What can't he do? One thing's for sure when it comes to our plucky sheriff. We love you, cowboy guy. Next story tonight, dog eats cactus and... Look, see? They, uh, they thought I was incredible and no one got hurt. I'm sure the fight was incredible, but you really need to start paying attention to the damage the town has faced from the fights. We can't afford to repair the saloon five times a week. I think we have enough money, and, and that was like the fourth time this week, but w what is that machine next to you? Oh, this? I made this machine to help me keep track of all the reckless damage done to the town while you're trying to save it. I call it the Sheriff Cowboy Guy Machine for Tracking Indirect Reckless Youth of Town's Wealth, aka Skabudua for short. You press the big silly button on the big silly hat, Enter the amount of damages caused to the surrounding property, people, etc. And then, after that, you enter the number of times a bad guy comes after and is beaten by Cowboy Guy. And then the results get printed out and the town's debt is revealed. Yay! Well, I mean, that machine's really cool and everything, don't get me wrong, but it just kind of makes me feel like you don't have any faith in me. Oh no, I don't. I'm just trying to be a supportive friend. Okay, well, I don't really know how to feel about that, but, um, how long will it take for that machine to give an answer? Oh, I did it while you were watching yourself on TV. I haven't read it yet. I wanted to wait for you. Oh, that's actually really sweet of you. Thank you. I bet the debt won't even be that much. Alright, after everything's calculated, the town's debt comes out to be- Wait, wait what? what? $239,503.05? That has to be a mistake. Maybe I put the numbers in wrong. I mean, I know I couldn't have, but it could be that. I mean, how could this much damage have happened from just this week alone? Hmm... Okay, uh, I'll be 100% honest with you. I can only really remember the things I did today. We've got to come up with a way to make this much money with not a lot of time. I'm not even sure what we can do to make the best of the situation. Well, I know the situation we're in seems dire, and I know I'm a goofball, and... I mess things up a bunch, but I really think I have an idea to save the town. Uh, this is my fancy little sheriff's badge that gives me hope when I need it most, and I feel like we both need hope or luck right now. 
We can do this, Straw Betty. We can really save the town. Just follow my lead, and I think my plan will lead us to victory. Really? A lemonade stand. You think you're going to make $239,503.03 from this? Um... Yes. Yeah, yeah, I did. Well, people like lemonade, Betty. And plus, we live in the desert. The sun's always hot, so it's genius. Why does the menu just say lemons and glass? That sounds awful. Oh, I thought it would be false advertising if I didn't say that. We have lemons and glass. Hey! Hey, I overheard you have lemons and glass. Can I have some? I just love this stuff. Why, yes, you can partake in this great idea. That'll be one dollar, please. Hmm. Hey, thanks, man. That sure is lemons and glass. Have a blessed day. Man, I'm just hooked on this darn drink. It's too good. See, what did I tell you? Lemonade sand 100% works. It worked. But that's just a dollar. You still need $230,000. Well, all right, that last plan of mine might have been a f like a little mess up, but I have a web way better idea this time. An idea so great, so amazing, that it will 100% save the town from financial debt, and we will be safe forever. A bake sale? Yeah, bake sale. I mean, think about all the amazing things we could have. We could have cookies, donuts, pie, cake, cupcakes, dog, lemon loaf, bread, white bread. You know what? I'm going to go home and sleep this off. We can come up with something 100 times better than whatever these two ideas were. Oh, alright, well, I promise while you're gone, I will make sure to solve this problem. It's my mess and I pretty much caused it, but I promise I'll be able to come up with a solution to save the town. You can trust me with this. You've got this, Sheriff Cowboy Guy. I actually have a tiny bit of faith in you. I'll be back later. I'm just sleepy. Alright, so the, that lemonade stand idea and that bakery, that bake sale idea might have flopped, but I, I gotta come up with something. I mean, I've gotta have one good idea in my head, right? Ugh. Hey man, can I borrow that pencil? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, you can have one. I'm not really using them. I appreciate it. I hope this dollar covers it. Wait a minute. This gives me an idea on how to save the town. If I can help others, then I can get money. And if I get money, I can save the town, which is helping others. This is the greatest plan I've ever come up with. Betty will be so proud of me, I, I saved the town. I just gotta do some stuff for people. Yes, I knew this plan was a great idea. It worked. Okay, time to see how much I actually made. I have a pretty good feeling that I made, you know, $230,000. Okay, let's see, I see a one, uh, I see a few coins, a five, a sand dollar, I, uh... I guess I only made about $6.03. I, I failed. Has, has anyone seen a black Honda? I'm so lost. Hey man, is everything okay? 
No, everything's not okay, actually. I mean, I tried everything I could. I, I came up with so many ideas, but I couldn't save the town from debt. Well, I'm not sure what to tell you, but I bet everything will get better. You know, I'll be honest, I, I really doubt it. I mean, it feels like no matter what I do, everything's gonna end up failing, so what's the point in even trying? Anyway, how much for the juice? You owe us six dollars for the juice. I hope you find what you're looking for. Thank you, it means a lot. Um, again, I don't know. Sorry for being so sad tonight, but uh, the town doesn't close. You. If it wasn't for you right now, I wouldn't know how terribly in debt this town was. It's your fault that I've been stressing so much. It has nothing to do with me. I'm a good sheriff. I can't seem to find that darn cowboy anywhere. Where is that goofball of mine? <laughs> Wherever could that boy be? Ah, I got you. I win. Oh, there you are. Are you excited for your first day of kindergarten? Yep, and I'm all dressed up. What do you think? I'm a cowboy. You look so adorable. We gotta get you to school, though. You don't want to be late. You've got that right. Let's go already. Welcome to kindergarten, everyone. Let's start off with roll call, okay? Ralph Barks? Yep, I'm here. Hammer Girl? Yes, ma'am. Um, I don't think we know your name yet. Please introduce yourself to the class. <clears throat> I'm a cowboy! I want to save the town and beat the bad guys and help everybody. I have a little gold badge and everything. <laughs> look at the blood. You look kind of stupid. I look stupid. What happened, buddy? Are you all right? I don't want to be a cowboy anymore. What? Everyone made fun of me. I can't do it, Mom. Well, you know what I think? I think you're going to be the greatest cowboy there ever was. I love you, Mom. I love you too. <sighs> oh geez, I think I overslept. I think it was out for like two weeks, I think. Wait, are you okay? Yeah, I, I think so. It's just, I was really hoping my ideas would work out. I feel like I failed everybody. Oh, uh, well, I think you had all right ideas. They just didn't work. Huh? Wait, did you hear that? No, what is it? Wait, Betty, look! Look! Cowboy guy! Nostalgia critic here! 
I just wanted to say, I heard you've been going through a rough time, man. Yeah, I know you just wanted to be the best sheriff, cowboy guy. You just really wanted to do things well, but I know you're at like a real low and you wanted to save the town as the best sheriff, but it didn't work out. I'm telling you, cowboy guy, I'm telling you, you can still pull things together. Right now, you're at a four out of 10. You know, I, I'm not gonna lie, that, that, that's not great, but you can pull it together. I, I mean, I don't think you understand who you are. You are a cowboy guy, cowboy guy, man. And I think you'll be a fantastic sheriff and the town is as good as saved, man. Just take my advice and things will be good. Yes, sir, Mr. Critic. Who are you talking to? How much juice did you drink? Not, not that much, but I do have an idea that could save the town, I think. Whisper, 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 whisper. Are you sure? That means... Yeah. Yeah, I know. Welcome to Cash for Gold. Are you sure you want to sell this? Alright then. Well, with my badge having sold for a, you know, a good buck, I think we can pay off the town and keep some extra, but... I really think you should be the sheriff. I don't think I can handle it, Betty. You're just, you're more responsible than me and I bet you could do it. Wait! Oh, what's up? I'm so proud of you, cowboy guy. You really did save the town. I'll tell everyone what you did for them. Please just know we all love you. I'd love for you to be my second in command, like my co-sheriff. I think that sounds absolutely perfect, Betty. Oh god, I think I uh, I think I just twisted my ankle. <laughs> <laughs>